So, today I am with Mr. Frank and Mr. Cristo, and today we are going to go along Placencia and we're going to pinpoint all the important spots or all the favorite spots that you should be able to know when coming to Placencia. That is correct. Now we're starting absolutely on the north end of the peninsula. So for people that come in by car, this is more or less the area where you turn into the peninsula. Um, Krista and I are going to give you a little guideline or a little guided tour of all the different areas. Hi. Um, this side side, so everything is like one main road. So it's one paved road that goes from the top of the peninsula all the way to the end to the Placencia village. But there's a several, what we're going to do today is we're going to turn into several of the side streets so that we're going to have a good idea of what is hidden behind the main road, right? So this area is called Caribbean Way. Caribbean Way is a very nice high-end development um, area completely off the main road. People like it because of that, you know, mm -hmm. so it's a little bit less traffic, there's no passage. As you can see here on the left side, brand new homes under construction. Um, it's completely residential, so you will see it's all brand new homes, 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 homes all high-end homes in this area. The road is unpaved here, but um, you still have underground electricity as well, so it has everything that you need to build your big Caribbean dream home. And I can understand in the sense of Apart from Maya Beach and the roads that you take onto the lagoon, this is the only road that you can be on on the peninsula that's not on the main Placencia road. Yeah. 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 So you're here on the beach, but you don't have any of the passing traffic. Mm -hmm. So as you can see, it's all very nice. Big it's already very developed, but it's still one of the spots where we can find most of the oh, little bird. Yeah. So um, there's still most of the beach lots that are available are in this area. Okay? So for example, here we have um, a house available. This is called Angel's Landing. Wow, it's, it's beautiful. Yeah, it's a two bedroom. It's a um, rental home with a swimming pool. It's on a very large lot. Uh, what does that price for it, Crystal? 650. Yeah, I think it's a wow. 650, 650 uh, 645, that's, 650. Yeah. That's awesome and has a very long rental history, you know, with uh, very clean books to show what the rental history was. Mm -hmm. Closer to the village, there's almost no, there's almost no more beachfront available. Yeah. And here in this area, we still have several properties on the beach available. Um, like these lots here, I'm not sure if you can see the beach. Not really, it's very bushy. Oh, we can show the one next door. But this one here is for sale, but we'll show you the one next door because this one is cleared. So with a similar lot next to this one, goes for like two ninety nine. All right. So we're talking thousands in US dollars, right? All right, US. Yes, two hundred ninety nine thousand. So now we're coming out of Caribbean Way again, right? um, up to the main Placencia Road, and here you have absolute wonderful views of the lagoon and the mountains yes. um, we'll see if you can find a little spot here where we can take a look at that so this is actually the end of the lagoon so if you see the peninsula the placentia lagoon this is actually the end where it all goes back so across there is actually the main line. here around uh, feeding time you know when they eat you know like when we were here with clients always like four o'clock 5 p.m uh, you can see the manatees rolling around in the seagrass because they always come to eat at certain spots Thank you. 